Well, folks, uh, Sean Mize here, and in this video, I'm going to show you how to convert into uh, a keynote. I'm going to show you pages to keynote. Now, and I'm, I, I use a software called PDF to keynote. And for Word, there's software out there to convert Word to PowerPoint. And but I, since I haven't used any of them, I can't recommend a certain one. So what you may want to do is, well, try a couple different ones out and see how it works. I'll show you exactly how this works, pages to, to Keynote. It should be very similar for PowerPoint. And I'll just talk you through it. Rather than try and explain the whole thing to you, I'm just going to, to talk you through it. So let's open up the, the document. This is going to be, you know, the document. And let's do this. Let's convert this to a PDF. And we'll just uh, put it in here. And let's call this ready to convert. So it's exporting. Then I'm going to open up PDF to Keynote. And I'm going to go File. Open. Okay. And so then... See, I don't use this a whole lot. So then we'll do save to. It's going to convert it to, to, to Keynote. And, well, I think that's a fine place to put it right there. So we save it. Then when it, so it's saving the whole thing. Now it's going to open it. That's a different video I've been doing. So it's going to open it. And eat, this is each one of those slides. Okay, this is each slide. And, of course, as... Okay, there you go. There you go. Now, um, I like the size of the, the, the type. If you don't like the size of type, you want it bigger. So now, let's talk about a couple of things. I've done this in Helvetica in 24 point. You know, we could have done the whole thing. We could change this body style, this, this copy style to a, a different size. If we do that, we'll have to re go through each slide and make sure that they're formatted correctly because some of those slides are full pages and it's going to shift them. So I'm not going to do that to mine. You'll want to come up with a number that works for you. You'll notice also that I tried to center most of these in the center of the page by adding a few lines at the top. And as you can see, the reason for that is well, you want them to show up in the middle of the page. And so what it does also, this also explains why I created a different page for each slide because each page comes up as a new slide. Now, I've never used Word to put a PowerPoint. It should be really similar. But let me make one recommendation, though. Make yourself like a three-page test document. Convert it over to PowerPoint just so that you get the wrinkles out. I know that the first few that I did, I had to get the wrinkles out. Now, it's not so hard to get the wrinkles out. You come in here and you change the size of something. You change the formatting. It takes you 10, 15 minutes. You reconvert it to PDF. You send it over to, to, to uh, uh, PowerPoint or, or Keynote. And there you're there. Now, I'm ready. At this point, I am, I'm ready to record. I am I'm ready to record. I'm going to teach that on a a uh, a different video. You know, by the way, thinking about this, let me, let me just take a look. I, I notice just off the top of my head that let's see this is just an intro. Let me see if I can open a recent one. open up another one. I don't remember if I use a picture on, no, I haven't in the past, so I think 
I'm going to, I won't use a picture on this one. It, you know, it kind of really goes either way, you put a picture on or not. And um, folks, this may be a decision. I may go ahead and throw my picture in on on this one or or not. I, I'm not. I'm not sure. I have to find this other one that we just did. Must be this one here. So I may add a picture to this, or I uh, I may not. So either way, this is ready to convert. Obviously, if I were to add a picture, I've already shown you in the other video how we added this other graphic. I just do the same thing with my name. Where is that graphic? It's in here somewhere. So I added that graphic. Same thing. You just add the picture the same way. Okay, folks, let's go ahead and kind of wrap this video up.